everybody, it's Mr. Man K Gamer, and I am back at you, aka Lionel, and I am in the house. Yo, what is up everybody? We are back again playing some more Advanced Warfare. And hope you guys like this gameplay because me, I personally love this gameplay. But guess what? This gameplay came at the most worst time, uh, you know, it could ever happen when you're a gamer. You know, I sat down, had the house to myself, didn't have my daughter and shit like that. About to just kick it old school, just me, pretending I'm 10 years old playing one of my favorite games. Next thing you know, get a knock at the door, and guess what? The fucking homies. I'm like, oh my god, what do y'all niggas want? Oh, go down, baby, get ate up. I'm like, what do y'all niggas want? Ooh, get ate up again. So I open the door, they're like, hey man, can we chill? I'm like, shit, man, alright, then fuck it. Ended up playing two or three games, and they're talking my head off. I keep forgetting, I didn't even hit the Elgato record button. Anything, though, know, that's why this game is like about 30 seconds cut off, because I hit the record button. Into look, look at this fool right here. He just stands there and just lets me unload. You know? But other than that, hey, it worked out for me. So <laughs> anyway, the whole time I'm playing this game, you're gonna notice I'm kind of doing shit I really don't do. Like I'm hesitating. Uh, you know, I'm, look at that. Oh, get out of here! I'm out in the open. I don't really stand out in the open. I like to camp and get out the way. But I just have this nigga in my ear just talking and talking about the game. Be like, man, they got EXO what? I'm like, they're called EXO. So you watch it. Oh, go to sleep. And it's funny that. I just hit that guy because at the same time I punched him yesterday, the other guy was like, oh man, you just hit him like Mike Tyson. I was like, oh, all right, sir, all right. You know, that right there is what happens when you ooh, headshot at the end. That's what happens when you invite your friends over and tell them it's cool to come over and they invite their friends. People, you're like, uh, okay, why is he, uh, you know what, fuck it. So while I'm trying to beast mode in this game, like doing, like, I never camp here. I'm just panicking because the dude is in my ear. Look at that, that would never happen to me. Like, a guy is is talking in my ear, asking me questions about this fucking game, and I'm trying my best to be polite and answer him. I'm trying to play. Look at me, see, I'm distracted. I'm shooting my own teammates, and she's there's a girl right there laying down. She's like lying behind you. I'm like, what? What? I don't know what to do because the nigga go. What? Oh, there you go. Thanks for the call out. But I'm sitting there trying my best to stay. Ooh, another one. I'm trying my best to stay in the zone, but I got a whole bunch of people in my ear at my house just talking my ear off. Look at that. I would have never stayed in the open that long man i was just rushing trying to answer questions talk to these motherfuckers just uh, amuse them for a little bit so anything you know i was like fuck it let me just go back to my camping spot and just wait for kills to come to me because i cannot concentrate with niggas in my ear but anyway before i conti uh, continue this little commentary about this game what do you guys think Ooh, i got somebody what do you guys think about the whole snaps uh, the snapchat fiasco going on about the new uh, call of duty 2015 I watched it and honestly it ain't really much I can take from it because I don't know how to analyze the shit out these videos like everybody else do. But honestly it does look like it could be a Black Ops 3 for the simple fact I don't know if they want to keep it Black Ops 3 but it kind of makes sense. It's like listen to the sound of my voice. And you think about it Black Ops 1 and had you know they like Mason you know what I mean. His mind was getting fucked with with numbers and all that shit so you never know they could be bringing Mason back. They could bring something like that and then at the end if you watch it it has they have a tree. The same tree that on I believe on Black Ops 2 is it that uh, Mason is climbing a tree with his father it's the same as that tree in the middle of nowhere in the snow before the helicopter lands so I think that I don't know if it's Black Ops 3 that'd be fantastic Ooh, how the hell did I survive that bomber run baby that's awesome but if it's Black Ops 3 that'd be fantastic because I was one of them players I got Modern Warfare 2 then I own I played every Call of Duty but I was late to the online thing I got more Modern Warfare 2 and then I got online, and by then, oh, it's own motherfucker. You know, I got online around Modern Warfare 2, and I did play Modern Warfare 2 for about three months before Black Ops 1 came out, so I was like, oh shit, so I wasn't really on to the online world and didn't really, each game that comes out, you know what I mean, I adapt and I get so much smarter of what's going on and understand like the game, not just playing the game, I'm we talking about the backstories, playing these shit. So now I'm, you know, I actually can go along with the flow. Like I know what's going on in A Dub. I know how important it is these games come out made right, not just for entertainment playing, you know, purposes. <laughs> just you know, for the company's sake. So that's what now I've been keeping up on like the Twitters and all this stuff and finding out this fun little story we all the game. Look at this shit. I was at this point right here, the guy I'm just letting you guys know the, the motherfucker is still in my ear 
drunk. Now I should add that in early. The motherfucker is in my ear drunk asking me questions about this game. And he's like, oh man, you just shooting rockets from your arm? Oh, really? Rockets? Oh man, they had rockets back when I used to play Atari. I'm like, come on, Grandpa, leave me alone. Now that I think about it, look at this guy. He just wanted me to kill. Now I think about it, I'm like, Grandpa, what? I'm 27. My homies are like 30, you know, 29 and shit. This nigga like almost 50 years old. I was like, what are, I was like, you know what? Fuck it. If you're paying for the beer, you can come over. <laughs> That's the only thing I can say. But yeah, look at that. that I would have never died like that. But uh, another thing too, I had the headsets off. I had them around my neck trying to be polite, answer these guys' questions. So a lot of these deaths that happened, I know you guys are like, what the hell? But you know, I just fucking couldn't get my mojo working. But like I said, this game is up here for a reason. Even though I'm complaining about I was distracted so much, I was distracted, but I was focused because, you know, I had the homies here. I had to represent. I didn't want to play this game and get my ass whooped while the homies are here. The niggas ain't never going to let me live it down. So, but that being said, your boy goes on the tear. I finished this game extremely fucking well. As you can see, it's 55 61. How do you think you want to save the day with shots like that? Shots to the balls. <laughs> I'll kick some ass towards the end. So, it's 59 62. This game looks out of reach. And this is where I'm like, you know what? Fuck it. My boys are here. They want to talk shit. They gonna, they, they're teasing me right now. Now my team's losing. So I'm like, all right, then fuck it. They're like, oh man, you got a gold gun? I said, yeah, let me go hand with this motherfucking gun. So now it's time for me to go on my little tear real quick and get this game back in shape and kick some ass, man. But other than that, I hope you guys are enjoying your little day. I am so happy the kids are back in school, man. Oh, get the fuck out of here. There you go. Mike Tyson up gut, but I'm so happy the kids are back in school, man. It gives me that time to actually play the game, and my homies don't go over much because their kids are out of school, so they got to make sure they be home and get their little ooh, 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 drop shot, too. Make sure they pick their kids up. So that means I have more gaming time without distractions, and I'll be able to post up more lovely ass-kicking videos. But with that being said, look at these. Headshots towards him, 70 70, and I'm just lead. taking it. I'm like, you know, fuck this. I'm gonna make sure my team win. I gotta do my best to kick some ass. But uh, other than that, this video is coming down to the end. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Your boy is kicking ass. And look, and look at that. 74. Oh, no. 75 71. I know for a fact. I personally brought my team back, and that's why I had to put this gameplay up. But hopefully, no more distractions. I'll be able to put up more Call of Duty videos while the homeboys coming through, aggravating the fuck out of me. That was just a quick little gameplay. Hope you guys like it love it share it and uh tell me what you think about the new call of duty 15 oh 20 and 5 kick ass hey i just want to say thanks for watching the video this is your boy mr man k gaming aka lion o i'm in the building i'm in the house please like and subscribe to my videos pass the word around and thank you for all the love and support peace out